Buzzwords Unveiled, Cracking the Code of Trendy Language. Hello, dear viewers. Welcome back to our channel, the place where we make English learning easy and fun. Today, we're going to decode a very interesting term that you might have heard floating around in business meetings, tech talks, or even casual conversations, the phrase, buzzword. So, if you're ready to expand your vocabulary and sound more like a native, stay tuned and let's dive into the buzzing world of buzzwords. A buzzword is a word or phrase that becomes very popular for a period of time, especially in a particular field. These words often sound technical or important and are used to impress someone or to sound in the know. They can be jargon from technology, business, academia, or even pop culture. For example, terms like synergy or blockchain started as buzzwords within their industries. People use buzzwords for several reasons. They can make an ordinary idea seem more exciting or they can make someone seem more knowledgeable or on trend. Companies might use them in marketing to attract attention. However, buzzwords can also be vague or be used so much that they lose their meaning. It's important to use them carefully to ensure clear communication. Let's look at some examples of common buzzwords. Sustainability often used in environmental and business contexts. Innovate, a favorite in tech and business to mean making something new or improved. Big data, a term that has gained popularity with the rise of data analytics. Gig economy, describing a market characterized by short-term contracts or freelance work. To use buzzwords effectively, understand their meaning fully before using them. Use them in the appropriate context, not just to sound smart. Avoid overusing them, or they might lose their impact. Remember, a well-placed buzzword can be powerful, but misuse can make communication buzz less. And that's a wrap on buzzwords. I hope this video has clarified what they are, why they're used, and how to use them wisely. Thank you for watching. And I hope you feel a bit more confident in navigating the dynamic landscape of English vocabulary. Keep practicing, and don't let those buzzwords buzz you out. Until next time, keep learning and stay curious.